Hi Libra, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do a reading for November. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For some reason I felt like I needed to do yours right now. And I feel as though there's some sort of unraveling going on. It's like there's been something that, something's been a big mess. It's been a big mess of some sort. There's, it's like untangling a mess. I think uh, there's a there's something that is about to be unraveled or untangled or something like that. And I also feel like you will be loved. It's like you will be loved. So maybe that's a song for you. Uh, you will be loved, whatever that means. Um, and, it, and it feels like a wish is going to be granted as well because I had to put that star there for you. And it wasn't there. I started the video. I already started this video. And... I stopped right after I said, hi, this is Jennifer. You know, right after I stopped, I said, I got to bring the star down because the star is for uh, Libra. It's like a wish ha is being granted. Something that you have been wishing for is being granted, Libra. And it has to do with love because uh, the red, red is a symbol of love. So I, whatever, and then this, cause there's love is, love is love. Whether it's love of a parent, love of a, of a lover, love of a child, love is love. So this month is about love, fate, and destiny, wish fulfillment, a, something that you wished for, a dream, is something is happening and it has to do with something being unraveled. Before I started this uh, reading, I went to move my computer and it was all tangled up in my computer, the cords. Then I moved that computer several times a day okay the cords are never tangled up like that then I went to move it and something fell over so it was like a big freaking mess and I have learned that there is no such thing as coincidence so this is a message that you need to hear there's no such thing as coincidence everything happens when it is supposed to happen I can tell that there is something that is about to be unraveled and it's like you know something is about to be leveled out and I think that you are going to um, start to feel more balanced. Something is happening for you that you is going to help you. Okay, it's, something is going to help you. <coughs> Excuse me, Libra, your God, angels, spirits, and universe. I just saw the nine of cups. I didn't see it in the cards. I just saw it. So the nine of cups is wish fulfillment. That is a wish, something that you have been thinking about, manifesting perhaps, I'm not sure. Some Something, something that you have been, maybe you were, you were even doing it subconsciously. Uh, something you've been hoping for is, is coming. Eight of Swords Reverse, this is um, coming out of conflict, coming out of mental conflict. An obstacle is being removed, some sort of obstacle. Something that was in the way. Queen of Cups. Yeah, you will be loved. You will be loved. Happiness is coming. A new opportunity. A new door is opening. You may be going through a new doorway. Um, you will be loved. And you, you are going to be very, very happy with whatever this outcome is. It's like... Um, Somebody is taking a risk. I'm not sure if it's you or somebody else that you're dealing with. Somebody is taking a risk and I think this risk is going to pay off. And it, whatever this payoff is going to be, it's going to bring emotional fulfillment to you. Uh, something is going to make you really, really, really happy. Oh, it's time. It's time. The time is now. The time is now. Everything happens for a reason. Everything happens for a purpose. Purpose. Balance is about to be restored in your life. Something you're going to start to feel more at peace, more in harmony with yourself. Um, you're about to receive some tender love and care, Libra. You are. You are. Knight of Swords. So some, something is going to change very fast. Something. It's like all of a sudden something changes. 
And whatever this is, it's going to break you free from something that you have been stuck in. You have been trapped in. If you've been trapped in mental conflict or you've been trapped in a situation against your will even. If you've been stuck in a situation, you're about, it feels like you're going to be broken free. It's like somebody is coming to the rescue to break you free. If this isn't that case, this could, this may, this reading may or may not resonate with you. This is, this is somebody, uh, rushing in and it feels like they're going to cut you free from something. I don't know what this is. Whatever this is, this person, it's going to happen very suddenly. This may be a shock. Okay. Um, judgment reversed. Queen of Swords reversed. Wheel of Fortune reversed. Okay. So you have been stuck. You have been stuck. But now there's a new opportunity. There is a new opportunity. I think there's somebody is opening a door door for you. There's like a new enterprise or a new path because somebody decides to take a risk. Um, worried. Somebody's worried about you, Libra. That's what this is. Somebody's really, really, really worried about you. They probably see your stress. You may be down and out. You may be feeling alone. Um, you may feel like... Uh, Wow, this Queen of Swords reversed. This is somebody that is lonely, bitter, sad. Uh, you can't communicate. You feel you may feel like somebody is, has been trying to shut you up. And you, I think that you are unaware. You may you may have been doubting that you're ever gonna be loved. You may be unaware that you know uh, something is gonna change for you. This is, you got something that is going to change. You may, you may, you may have your doubts. Okay, you may have your doubts that things are going to change. But I feel as though um, there is some tender love and care headed your way. There absolutely is. It's going to help to hear, heal you. This is healing from bitterness. So if you've been bitter, if you've been lonely, if you know you've been feeling like you have nobody to talk to. I think that somebody is coming in. Somebody is going to come to assist you in some way to help you to get unstuck. Somebody from your past. This is somebody from your past. Somebody that, uh, I don't know if it's a parent. It could be a parent. It could be a sibling. It could be somebody from your family. There is somebody from the past that is basically, I think this person's coming to cheer you up. They're coming to help. Get you unstuck. It is now this could lead to a happy family. This could lead to a lot of happiness. Um, five of Wands. I think there's been too many people uh, meddling. There's been too many people uh, causing problems in your life, causing struggles, causing conflict. To meet many people um, intervening, you know, just putting their two cents in when they should have just not been involved in the first place. Um, I think these people are, have really brought you down. They've, they've shut you up. They've tried to shut you up. Or maybe they even managed to shut you up. But I think that's over. You could even have a mother that is coming to help you. Um, the Emperor reversed. You were being controlled by somebody. You were under somebody else's control. Um, there's about to be some disorder, by the way. Things are about to become chaotic. I think that we had somebody, you had somebody in your life that was very controlling and manipulative and uh, probably acted in a stupid manner, maybe out of ego, definitely with all these people right here, wanted to prove themselves to everybody and it was all a lie. Okay, these are mirroring each other. But I think what goes around comes around and I think that you are about to, things are about to change for you. Okay, things are about suddenly. This is like a sudden change. I feel as though whoever has been manipulating you and controlling you, I think this person's about to get a rude awakening. I do. Seven of Wands reversed. 
Now this, somebody has been over, you've been overly criticized, right? Somebody has been criticizing you. You may feel like you've been attacked, not heard for sure. Somebody hasn't been hearing you. They haven't been listening to you. They haven't been even, it's like they haven't even been letting you speak. It's like it's been completely out of your control. There was nothing that you could do. But I, I feel like there's some going to be a, some sort of reunion with somebody from your past. This person, it's like all of a sudden this person steps up, steps into the picture and changes everything. Something is about to change. It feels like you're, all the men, the main card of this reading is the Eight of Swords reversed. An obstacle that has been keeping you trapped, keeping you stuck, keeping you uncomfortable is about to be removed. That is the that's the main message here. There's there's a there's a healing energy. There's a happiness. It's like happiness being restored. Knight of Wands. Things are gonna happen really, really, really fast. It's like seriously, all of a sudden, somebody takes action. You could be dealing with a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or a, it could be anybody, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Either way, somebody is about to take a big risk. They're going to, they're going to, this is a risk. This, this guy's playing heads or tails. They're about to take a risk. And um, it's like going back. Somebody's going back because the Wheel of Fortune is reversed. They're going back to their, to where they lived when they were a child or something like that. Going back to their childhood. Something like that. Um... And going back to the past, this leads to happiness, a happy family, a happy home. Somebody is taking action to restore balance. This is a, this is a very sudden decision. It's a sudden change. This is this is a very loving gesture. So some, it's like you will be loved. You will be loved. Somebody is heading in like whoo, lickety split. Seriously, lickety split. It's like whoo. it's like they come and they it's like they swoop you right up and take you out of this bad predicament, whatever it is. You are in a bad predicament, but I think they're this is like your hero. It is. Um Interesting. Yeah, somebody is coming in very, very, very quickly. Somebody was holding on to a dead end. Resisting change. We have a very egotistical individual here. <coughs> Huge ego. The Emperor Reverse. This person is angry. This person is unreasonable, um, conceited, self-centered. Doesn't. It's all about power and control. This person is probably going to be up against. This person is now going to. Uh, have to put up a fight. They have been putting up a fight anyway. They've been overly critical. It's like they didn't even care. They did not even care. Now this is holding on to a dead end. The need to release. But somebody was so egotistical that they couldn't release. But there's an end of relationship here. There's an end of a friendship, end of relationship. This could be in the family. Could be with a father. You could be dealing with a father that, um, you know, the relationship is dying. And you have to let that relationship go to uh, have your peace, to have your balance back in your life. I'm not, I'm not, I don't know if it's a father, but whoever this is, it's like th there's a relationship that is going south with this. And it's like it's it's dying and there's been a delay. There's been a resistance to it, you know. But I feel like when this happens, you know, this there's probably going to be an argument, by the way. A fight with the Seven of Wands. Whoever this person is. There's going to be something that happens that probably makes you feel uncomfortable. 
and it may it may be emotional and it may be it may be emotional it may be um dissatisfying you may feel like this is overwhelming but whatever this is it's going to help you to find peace and balance and harmony in your life it's like a sudden 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 change it's like boom life changes just like that you will be loved you're going to be loved yep five that's a hierophant card this is a card of faith have faith that everything happens for a reason. Believe it. Believe it. And the reason, the temperance card, is the reason. Everything does happen for a reason. Now, the, the Hierophant is um, a teacher. It, it, it is um, a, a, a counselor of some sort. A guidance. Divine guidance. You're, I think that you're... It's like... You're, you're being divine. Something is happening. Something. It's like God. Okay, I see this as God is is helping. Is is causing this change. This is a universe. It's like this is a universe too. It's like there's a higher power involved here that has orchestrated this whole thing. They've orchestrated this upcoming change. This upcoming movement. Somebody is about to take action. They're about to take action, and they're, it's because they, they believe. You could be dealing with a Taurus, they, it's like, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. doesn't matter. you got everybody here, so it doesn't matter. But it feels like we have somebody here that is a, is a mentor, is a teacher, is a guide of some sort. And whether it's God or it's somebody in this physical plane, it's like somebody is, is guiding this change, okay? There is a change that is upon you that is being guided, um, you could be dealing with a very spiritual person. This could, this could be a spiritual counselor or a spiritual healer that you're dealing with. Um, if this is a brand new relationship that is coming into your life, whoever you're dealing with is very, very, very spiritual. This person is, is a spiritual person. Just saying, um, whoever is coming in, this person is It's a spiritual teacher of some sort. Okay, take a look. I mean, that's what I, I need to tell you. Whoever is coming, whoever is coming to help is. These are messenger. This is this is this is action. This is action. This is a messenger. But these deliver messages. They deliver them. But anyway, um, this is like a messenger. This is somebody who listens and, and listens to God or listens to a higher power. Um, is highly awakened. This person is. This one is too. Whoever is helping you is a very awakened individual. And they are, it's like they're flying into your life. Flying. I don't know if this is a mother. And this could be somebody that has already passed away as well. It could be. So keep that in mind. I feel as though there is a reconnection with somebody from your past. It happens very, very quickly. Um, could be somebody from your childhood when you were young, really, 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 really young. Somebody just comes into your life and changes your future. Um, so Libra, that is what I have. You have the Ace of Pentacles on the bottom. You have a new golden opportunity that is about to be presented to you. And this could lead to something solid, stable, and secure. So you got something coming in in November. I don't think that you are aware that it is coming. That judgment card is reversed under here. That is not aware. You're not aware that it is coming. Um, whoever this person is, you know them. You do know them. So when I say it's somebody from the past, do not comment down below. I do not want somebody from my past. Somebody from your past could be somebody you never dated. It could be a child. It could be somebody you went to school with. It could be somebody you dated. It could be anybody. How many people do you have in your past? Everybody. One card, please. You have some sort of memory. Good memories. Good, positive memories of this person. Whoever this person is. Door to value. You could be dealing, I think, uh, who got this? Taurus or Gemini? Somebody else got this. 
but this is going this is a very valuable opportunity it's like spirit god angels is opening a door for you you could even be getting money this month okay you could be, you see an increase on in your money you could be getting getting an inheritance i don't know it doesn't maybe it's not money involved but whatever this is somebody is about to see your value I know this is about love. And whether it's child parent love or a family love or a lover, this is a month of love for you. And look up the song. I'll put the link. You will be loved. I just know it. I know it. There is an unraveling, too. There's an unraveling of a messy situation. Uh, oh, here it is. Self-sabotage. When you learn to get out of your own way, there will be no stopping you. Most of the time, it's not others who prevent you from achieving your true goals. It's that inner voice that derails those carefully woven plans. I gotta show you what's on the bottom because I know this is for you. You are not alone. We are here for you. We never left. Through all the sadness and loneliness, However, you cannot sense us near you or, or feel how much feel how much love we are sending you. We are your family, friends, and guides. You never walk alone. We are right, we walk right beside you. Somebody from the I knew it was somebody from the other side as well. You have you have somebody from the other side that is guiding somebody into your life to love you. And that is what I see. Good luck.